Well, here we are at the cottage again on Monday the 8th of April for a, a uh, catch up, see what we're up to. Kenneth's with me tonight, so let's go and have a look around. Oh, there's Ken. First thing you'll notice is the bathroom is now outside as opposed to inside. It's a hotel. <laughs> That's the, uh, the remains of the bathroom. It's and the, out of the house. Yeah, the shower door. And let's go on inside. Right, so everything's been stripped off here. The problem we've had with the ceiling um, is that uh, we've got to have it boarded and, uh, well, ply put on, then board in. Um, so that's hopefully the scout's going to pay for that, and that will happen this weekend. And. Yeah, so that was a bit of a hiccup from Friday, but uh, things have improved since. And if we get that done this weekend, that shouldn't hold us up. And there's Ken in the new bathroom, as it is at the moment. Oh, everything's all the water's off. That's where the, uh, the new um, thing will toilets will go. There'll be a shower there. We'll have new tanks in there. They've all gone out, the old ones. And we're also talking about um, eventually perhaps having uh, uh, central heating through the, uh, the wood burning stove. So we're going to have a, a boiler put in that will enable us to store heat, which will be good. So, it should be interesting once this is all changed. And then we go, I uh, don't think much else has happened here. I'll have a quick look in the cellar, but I've just tidied it up a bit from the last time, I think. Just that side's been cleaned. And into the whiskey snug <laughs> and so the fireplace is now ready to have the grate so we've got bricks at the front and we'll have those tiles on the top and the um thingy jig the lining's been put in today so we've got a new um sort of like chimney thing all the way up and there's that's it and there that thing goes all the way up to the top it's been swept so it's all clean so upstairs young ken well, thank you well. sir so upstairs, a bit dark because uh, we've got no electricity and no lights obviously on at the moment upstairs. So into Ali Alexandra's room and he's little bits of, actually I think most of this product we saw last time is he's boarded now where the, that uh, wood was and that will be in plaster this weekend. So this room should be finished off this weekend. I'm back in Oh, he's boarded there, you can see that. You can't see that, but from the other side. Into our bedroom, which is now finished, plastering wise. So the fireplace has all been plastered. And I've had a go at getting all the white off the fire. A bit more to do on that, but it's coming on. That's all been plastered. And we've got a nice feature of this uh, beam that runs across here. The windows all been plastered, all nice and clean. And last but not least, into the dressing room. And from here, this wall is um, totally shot. You can see there's all sort of plaster's falling away there. So that wants to get more plasterboard. So we're going to plasterboard and plaster um, and skim all that. So that'll be this room finished. That's all been tied up in that corner, which is the other side of the fireplace and that window bottom of the window still got to be done but other than that that's where we are and there's Ken again yeah. <laughs> let's see if we can see this landing on this side yes uh, so you've got plasterboard we were going to have spin walls but in the end um, well Matt decided to plasterboard it really and we thought oh, perhaps that's best with the kids are playing up here if they drop toys or anything they're only getting up going through the banisters so Probably best to do that, and it's plastic boarding on that side. And I think that's the phone ringing to say the tea is ready. So bye for now. Bye. <laughs>